My name is Betty Lou Cummings now, but it used to be Betty Lou Lundstedt, and I was one of the first women cheerleaders. It was 1954, and uh, we had to try out about 200 cheerleaders tried out, and six of us were chosen. And four of us were blonde, and two of us were <laughs> dark hair. And it was wonderful. We were really kind of famous all over Michigan because we were the only women cheerleaders. Usually it was just you men. <laughs> but anyway, I'm very happy to be back here. And I got to tell you this, that I'm a friend of the Senior Center in Westport, Connecticut, where I live. And every February on Super Bowl Sunday, I'm the one that's with my pom-poms, green and white, and a Michigan State shirt and my hat, and I'm the first one that leads out and says, welcome to our Super Bowl Sunday. So I'm still carrying on the, the tradition. I'm, I'm still a cheerleader. I mean, Spartans, come on in, yay! And I'm always singing to the kids, on the banks of the Red Cedar. Go green. <laughs> now would you do a little? Go, go green and white. I'm so proud of them. And the thing is, my husband and I got married when I could have gone to the Rose Bowl. And do you know what my father said? Betty Lou, you can get married any time, but you can't go to the Rose Bowl. But I was in love, <laughs> and and uh, my husband and I married. And I, I was telling the boys here that I was so excited because I thought this year, I said, Dad, I'm finally going to go to the Rose Bowl. <laughs> <laughs> Are you ready? <laughs> Give me an S, S. S. Give me a T, T. Give me an A. A. Give me a T. T. And give me an A. E. E. Yay! <laughs> Yay, State.